welcome to A Better Me, Personal Growth and Meditation with Harry Croner. Today I want to speak to you about emotional wisdom and it's really important to, to uh, start and approach our emotions in a different view, a different perspective to our emotions. When we think about our emotions, we used to think of things that need to be contained, controlled or managed and that is something that is um, very hard to do it sometimes and we feel that we are at the whim of these emotions and anxiousness and worry and doubt that uh, creep in about every different thing about our lives, uh, whether it's work, family, uh, finances, whatever it is that is causing us some angst, some unpleasantness in the body, in our mind uh, and preventing us from sleeping well, thinking and processing properly. So it's really about changing that outlook and giving yourself a new perspective and making peace with those emotions and shifting them so you can let go of them. So today I want to introduce to you a very important um, aspect of my work with my clients and, and just people. I think this is a wonderful tool and it's called the peace process. And the peace process has several steps and, and the most important idea about it is to really approach our emotions as wonderful messengers of things that needs to be addressed. It is really just part of us, our heart, our, our, our body, our mind that are trying to tell us there's something that needs to be addressed here, something that needs to be corrected in the way we approach things. Because as we know, it's not that we need to change the world, it's that we need to change the way we interact and, and, and uh, perceive the world. So it really is important to start shifting from within about this exceptional, exceptionally important part which is our emotions. So when we think about emotional wisdom, we bring ourselves to, to a, a, an important part and that is recognizing, first of all, recognizing what is it that is bothering us and where is it in our body. So uh, I will first of all like to go through the different steps and then we'll do it together in, in a form of meditation so we can really explore and uh, really uh, enjoy the process and do it together. So the first step is really recognize, first of all, I am feeling a certain emotion. It could be unpleasant, discomfort or even a good one, but we want to learn a little more about that emotion. So first of all, it's taking the time and realize, okay, I'm not feeling 100%. I'm not feeling neutral. I'm not feeling uh, in the way that I want to feel. Recognizing that moment and taking a few moments for yourself because it's really important to give ourselves the opportunity to do better and move away from that continuous uh, triggers that we allow those things and situations to continuously trigger the same emotion again and again. So it really is that, that process of letting go of that and not allowing those uh, situations uh, and circumstances become continuous triggers for the rest of our lives. So as we do that, the first step is give yourself some time. Give yourself some time to really let go and really allow yourself to feel that possibility that I can shift this. I can gain some deeper understanding, deeper wisdom into what is happening to me right now. So first of all, you take some time for yourself. You take a few moments to relax and take a few deep breaths and allow yourself to be at peace with yourself. As you do that, welcome the possibility that you are the observer of this emotion. Our emotions and our thoughts are something that does not control us. It is something that we, the experiencer, our real us, the core being of who we are, is just experiencing that emotion, that feeling. So we can approach it in a more neutral way and just really start to gain that perspective and look at it in a better way. So when you sit with yourself and relax, and we'll do so in just a few moments, give yourself the opportunity to think what is this emotion? What is this emotion that I'm experiencing? And really allow yourself to, as if you are taking it out of, out of from wherever it is in your body that you're feeling it and taking it outside of you. And what is this emotion? Is this anger? Is this frustration? It could be a combination of several of them too. And that's completely okay. When you do so, allow yourself to think further outside of the box. And where is it? Where does it reside in my body? Where does it sit? And, and most of those emotions that are, are feeling very, very disruptive to ourselves, the uh, uncomfortable, are usually sitting either in our, our chest 
or in our, in our solar plex, or in our, our belly, in our, in our tummy. So it really is, this is the most common ones, but obviously some of them sit anywhere in the body. So it is important to take a few moments and recognize where do I feel this emotion when I think about this situation specifically, or this whatever triggered me at this moment, where do I feel it in my body, and what is this emotion? And this brings you to a deeper understanding of yourself as a person, and start gaining that emotional wisdom and understanding of who you are and what triggers you. As you do that, it's time to also move on to the next level and start recognizing what is it trying to teach me? And really approach this emotion as a small entity, a small part of you, and simply address that emotion. What are you trying to teach me about myself? What is the lesson behind what is happening here? And really allow yourself to let go and allow yourself that, to engage in, in that insight into that deeper level of understanding about yourself. What is it trying to teach me? What is the lesson here? And the next step is even more evolutionary and more interesting as you do so, is once you start understanding the concept, the, 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 the process of what is happening here, what is it trying to tell you, where is it coming from, and you understand what is the root cause, and suddenly you bring that understanding, oh, I remember that when I felt it a while ago, a few years back, all, all the way to your childhood, it could be. So it really is understanding that original root cause of where it's coming from, and understanding that you can be at peace with it. And at that moment, it is important to thank that emotion for what it brought to you, what it gave you. So you really are in that process, when you think about that emotion that is in front of you, say thank you. Thank you, wonderful emotion. No matter what it was, it brought you that deeper understanding of who you are as a person, who you are, and understanding and, and allow you the ability to recognize that you can correct and heal things from deeper inside. Once you thank it, you can make peace with it. And make peace with it, and once you make peace with that emotion, you can say, I'm at peace with that emotion. I'm okay with that anger, I'm okay with that frustration, I'm okay with whatever that discomfort that I felt, and wherever it came from, I'm at peace with it. And once you make peace with it, you can start feeling, and you can start really recognizing, you can simply release it from the body, from wherever it was sitting in your body. So if you were sitting in your, in your chest, you can simply allow that, as I'm at peace with this emotion, I'm releasing it from me. And you can really feel the immediate dis dissipation of that feeling. As I like to say, you don't have to uh, um, uh, uh, confront those emotions. You don't have to fight the emotions. You actually have to make peace with it. And that's really the key here, to make peace with those emotions. And once you make that peace with it, once you are coming to it with the most unconditional love and openness to your own self, healing occurs. And once you make peace with it, you can enjoy that moment of, of serenity, of, of growth that actually happens at that moment. Because there's a moment of growth, of personal growth that takes place right at the, on, on the spot. As this takes place, the last step is to really just return to that scenario, return to that scenery, revisit it, then see how it takes place again. You can revisit the certain uh, situation you have just experienced, whether it's with a co-worker or at home with family, or whatever it is that brought you this unpleasant emotion. Revisit the same situation that you have started with, and you will already see it has been either completely neutralized, you will see the same situation without any of that animosity and anger and frustration, but you actually see it in a compassionate, open way, or simply neutral. It has no more of that emotional charge that has been troubling you and has been, been able to be pushed like a trigger every time that the same situation or similar situations happen. So enjoy that. And if it does not reach that full neutrality or full healing of the situation or of that emotion, revisit and continuously do the same process again. Go through the same steps, make peace with it, open it, see what it is, and see maybe the next emotion that is coming up and unraveling about the situation and do this process. It could be just take just a few moments and you'll see just a, uh, it only takes a few moments to do it properly. And you will gain great ability to heal yourself, to gain and experience your emotional wisdom and your knowledge that you have the power 
to heal yourself. So let's go to the meditation. All right, so let's begin. Let's take a few deep breaths and allow ourselves to relax and center ourselves. Relax and let go. Allow yourself to just feel how you are releasing and cleansing yourself with every breath. Close your eyes. It's easier to just let go when you close your eyes and disconnect from the environment for just a few moments and shifting within. Allow yourself that pure pleasure of letting go. There's nothing else you need to hold on to right now. And the breath and feel how you are bringing that emotion, that thought, that scenario into mind. And feel how you are revisiting it, replaying it within your mind. Allow it to take place, that's okay. Become the observer, as if you are sitting behind the camera and seeing this, feeling it. And allow yourself to revisit that situation that have triggered that emotion. Take a deeper breath now, and now allow yourself to imagine as if you can take that emotion, feel it where it is in the body. Where do you feel that tension, that knot? that unpleasantness or some discomfort in the body. When you take a moment, you can really feel that there's a center point to it. Now allow yourself to open your insight, deeper insight from within. Allow yourself to know what is this emotion? How may I call it? What am I feeling? And as you feel it, you know what it is, you recognize it, you know it resides in your body. Imagine you can simply take it out of you and hold it in your hand and have a conversation with it. Be gentle with the emotion. Allow yourself to be neutral with it, simply observing, accepting of what it is. And simply ask that emotion, as if you can talk to it, have a small conversation within. What is it you're trying to teach me? What is the lesson I'm here to learn from this emotion? Take a few breaths now. Allow that to take place. And you may also ask, where do you come from? And allow yourself to be very open and accepting it is okay. It's a very safe place to do that. And as you do that, allow yourself to now make peace with this emotion. Allow yourself to first of all accept it, what it is. It is what it is. It is where it came from. And I'm allowing it to be. You can say within, thank you. Thank you for the lesson you're teaching me. Thank you for pulling my attention so I can address this and heal it now. Thank you for the wisdom that is flowing through it. Thank you. And now I imagine you can simply make peace with it. Ease that. You can imagine as if you're holding a white dove in your hand, it's still a little fluttering, and you just calm it down, you relax it, you allow it to just be, and you allow that emotion to calm down. 
And you allow it now to dissipate and dissolve. And you allow yourself to feel it now within your body as you are making peace with the emotion. And you can simply say within yourself a very clear declaration. I'm at peace with this emotion. I'm okay with it. Take a deep breath. And take a few moments now to allow it to dissolve from the body as if it just flows right out of you. Flows right out. You can simply imagine that beautiful little white dove of peace flying away, flying away, making peace with that emotion. Beautiful. Now take another deep breath and feel how more at peace your body is, how more calm your mind is, your heart is at peace. Revisit that first situation that you have explored. Reimagine it. Observe how neutral you are now, how more accepting, compassionate, understanding you are towards others and yourself. Enjoy that process. And if you need to revisit it again, and continue this process, go ahead, do so again. Take another deep breath and be at peace with it. And as you can see, this is fairly short, it doesn't take too long, but it really is significantly helpful and healing and brings you great wisdom, clarity and freedom from triggers discomfort and stress. Enjoy this process. It will help you tremendously every segment of your life. Enjoy it. That's it for today. Do so again if you like. Have some fun with it. Be creative. Love yourself. Be compassionate and understanding towards yourself and others. Enjoy it.